This Thursday, you can eat at several local restaurants and at the same time help support the Northeast Florida AIDS Network, or NFAN. They're working on their 11th annual Dining Out for Life, and our Elizabeth Campbell has more. I own a company. We rehab houses for a living. We flip houses and we remodel each other, uh, other people's houses. Stephen Prophet stays busy with his work and personal lives, but he still makes time for his two favorite charitable organizations. North Florida AIDS Network. Uh, we do a lot of fundraisers for them. Um, we'll, ha we'll have bartenders fully catered here in the backyard. Our two favorite is Ronald McDonald's house and Enfic Enfan. So we donated a lot of money to them. Stefan and his husband love the Ronald McDonald House because it supports children. And they also love the Northeast Florida AIDS Network for their dedication to bettering the lives of people living with HIV and AIDS. I'm HIV positive for many years now, for the be better part of a decade. NFAN is a case management company. Um, however, they go above and beyond their case managers. They help out with food pantries, you know, for people who can't afford food, housing, rents, electric bills. He says the diagnosis was a life-changing moment. Becoming um, HIV infected myself, um, it changed my life in the sense that you want, you want to make better choices. You, ha you start becoming more aware of your health, your, your mental health, your physical health. Um, and that's what got me involved with Infan. Because Infan continues to help him, he wants to do what he can to return the favor to the organization. We do a lot of ho uh, fundraisers and stuff for Infan to help them out as much as we can financially. Um, because they, don't, they, they only have their grant money. Um, from the states that will only go to certain causes or s certain concerns that they have to address. According to the CDC, over half of youth 13 to 24 living with HIV don't even know it. Stefan says awareness is so important and he hopes the community will support Infan's Dining Out for Life this Thursday. Awareness is probably the most important issue with any disease. Um, regardless of what it is, um, to get out there, get the information out, how to protect you, um, whether you're married, single, if you're going to actively have a, a, an active sex life, um, it's, it's a where to obtain all that information. Nearly two dozen restaurants will contribute 25 to 50 percent of their proceeds to Infan. And you can bet Stefan and his husband will be enjoying several meals to support one of their favorite local organizations. I will be a part of it. My husband and I and a lot of my family will be a part of it and friends will be a part of it. Uh, we will do breakfast, lunch, and dinner at the participating restaurants. Knowing that basically it will just help other people. The, the money that they raise will help someone that can't work be able to pay their rent or have that food so they can survive with it. And of course, the, the people are always the greatest. I mean, the support in our community is growing tremendously wonderful. I'm Elizabeth Campbell for River City Live. So other than raising awareness, he says his number one message for people is to pay attention to your body, make sure you're keeping it healthy, eating well, exercising. And he also says that people need to understand that there is help and support out there for yeah. anyone going through any type of situation. It sounds like a really good idea and a great cause. Absolutely. Now, of all the restaurants that are participating, one of them is Orsay. They're here right now and Eden's with them, and they're going to give a sample of what to uh, expect on Thursday. Exciting. So 